I had my first appointment uh, three months later, and when I walked in, I had lost close to 35 pounds, and, and uh, my blood pressure was down, my sinuses was, were clear, and my doctor was shocked by, by the transformation in a short period of time. And I would eat a, a meal of you know potatoes, and I, I, I make uh, beans and rice, and I take those to work every day. In the morning, I take uh, raw oats, and I put fruit on top of them, and that's what I eat for breakfast, right? So I, I would eat to that until I was full, and I would test my blood, and it was like 115, 120, and I was like, wow, right? After a month of eating this way, and, and the, the difference in, the, in your health and the way you're gonna feel, you're gonna thank yourself, and you're gonna see that it's well worth it. I wasn't feeling well for some time, and I, I would not go to the doctor. I, I had severe headaches. I had a congestion. I had a, I used, I, my toes started to bl uh, tingle. I, I got a doctor who'd never seen me before, I didn't have a relationship with, so she, instead of talking to me, she got into the medical record, and she noticed that the previous December, this was in June of 2017, the previous December, my A1C was 6.8, I think. And then she says, I need you to go have your blood drawn right now. And I, I try to say, hey, you know, I didn't fast. And she says, I don't care, go do it now. And a day later, they, I got an email saying it was 7.1 and I was officially diagnosed as a type two diabetic. And I was sent uh, to have my eyes examined, have my feet examined. And, uh, and you feel like you're shocked. And you, 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 you say, you know, I really did it this time and I need, I, I need to get treatment. So at, at, at that point, I attended the classes they, they uh, sent me to, which were sponsored by my health plan. And the, the initial class, uh, they were talking about diabetes and what to expect and what to look for. And uh, by then, I had already done some research uh, online, and I and I real uh, and I came to know the term insulin resistance. And when during this class, I asked the the nurse because the guy was an RN. I asked him. So I said, I'm sorry, I don't mean to you know throw you off track, but. I, my understanding is that, that type 2 diabetes is insulin, insulin resistance and the guy goes that's a conversation for another for another day which blew my mind right because I go how can you talk about what I'm uh, what to, what I'm to expect what I should do if you don't tell me what my disease is and at that time I started doing research online that's when I found Cyrus uh, a recorded YouTube video of a, at a medical center in Southern California and upon hearing them and saying you can eat fruit. I said, you know, I need to talk to this guy. So I went to the retreat and, and uh, it, it was an incredible experience for me because it was a very nourishing, uh, supportive environment. I, I have fr I made friends that I'm still friends with to this date. And, I, and the education that I, the, that I received during those four days uh, immediately changed the way I lived my life uh, entirely. I adopted the, the diet, the style, you know, I, I eat primarily whole foods. Uh, I exercise five to six days a week. You meet everyone and you get, you're, get, you're given an outline of what's gonna take place over the next few days. And the next morning I walked in and there were buckets of bananas, mangoes, you know, kiwis. And I'm like, are you serious? I go, I'm gonna love this, right? And, and it, so you ate, healthy, really tasty foods. I didn't taste anything the entire time that, that, that left me wanting more. Quite the contrary, in the mornings I would say, I can't wait till it, to finish this bowl of mangoes, right, so I can get some more, and then you're finishing up going, wait a minute, I'm full, right? You realize that all the fiber and the water and the nutrients uh, it make it hard to overeat when you're eating fruit. You just stop when you're, when you're done. I, I was uh, shocked at the level of detail I've never heard such a deal about you know biology, chemistry, cell function, and uh, we started at 7 a.m. and ended at 10 p.m. every day, right? And and in between there were exercises that uh, we would exercise until you couldn't get off the ground anymore. And what impacted me the most is that you know Robbie and Cyrus would say, "Listen, uh, look around. Where where are the weights? Where's the gym? You don't need any of that stuff, right?" I'm exercising six days, five to six days a week for an hour at least, and I don't own uh, 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 dumbbells. I don't. I don't own anything. I I use my body for the only exercise equipment I purchased was a band that I hang from the door, 
so that I can do, uh, you know, lift uh, push-ups and sit-ups and stuff. That's it. That's all you need. People try to overcomplicate how one has to eat to nourish the body, right? It's very simple. You have your staples. You have rice, beans, and it, it, the, 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 the thing that blows your mind is that nobody tells you how to count. You don't have to count calories. You don't have to do anything. You just have to eat healthy food until you're, you feel satisfied. And, and, and when I talk to folks that they, they're trying the lifestyle for the first time, they, they overcomplicate what to look for, what to eat. The, the, the key here is to just eat simply, uh, add, add you know, spices as necessary. The, the book that you walk away with from the summit tells you everything you need to know. I had my first appointment uh, three months later, and when I walked in, I had lost close to 35 pounds, and, and uh, my blood pressure was down, my sinuses was, were clear, and my doctor was shocked by, by the transformation in a short period of time. She actually eventually signed up for the summit that Mastering Diabetes puts up. To find out how different foods were affecting me, I would actually test throughout the day, and I would eat a, a meal of you know potatoes, and I, I, I make uh, beans and rice, and I take those to work every day. In the morning, I take uh, raw oats, and I put fruit on top of them, and that's what I eat for breakfast, right? So I, I would eat to that until I was full, and I would test my blood, and it was like 115, 120, and I was like, wow, right? In the mornings, I was averaging between 85 and 91. I don't even test my blood anymore. When I run out of my first uh, supply of test strips, I never refilled my, prescri uh, my prescription because I was wasting my time. My blood sugar is normal in the mornings, throughout the day. My, the numbness on my feet went away. My, I, every, I, I just feel fantastic, and I know I'm not sick anymore. Like I said, I'll test my A1C one more time when I'm asked to do so by my doctor, but I'm not even concerned about what the results are gonna be. And that's in six months. I've lost close to 40 pounds, and uh, I don't even weigh myself anymore because it's irrelevant. I feel great. My, my favorite meal, it's rice and beans. I, I love it, right? Uh, it Maybe because I grew up eating beans, right? But uh, it's, uh, it, I, I get home, with a baked potato, rice, like it, it's funny because uh, all of a sudden I feel like I'm a little hungry at night. Instead of going to grabbing trash, I'll put, I'll throw a baked potato in the oven, right? Put a little a little um, uh, pepper on it, a little bit of salt, and I'm good to go, right? And it's satisfying, it's fulfilling, and I know that it's nourishing me and not not, not harming me. Do this for yourselves. I, the cost becomes negligible when you see the benefits afterwards. You're not going to spend money on co-payments. You're going to spend, spend money on going to expensive restaurants that are going to harm you. It, it's a, it's a, I would call it a no-brainer. You have to do this for yourself. After a month of eating this way and, and the, the difference in, the, in your health and the way you're going to feel, you're going to thank yourself and you're going to see that it's well worth it. One.